Hi! Um, well, it's been a while since I'm back from my vacation and I just dived back into work, to be honest. Um, before I went on vacation, I posted my first vlog uh, and I also said that I would do it more often, so that's why I'm in front of the camera again. Um, well, it's just kind of weird because talking to my camera isn't really something I do often. But, well, just um, let's go. Um, first, I want to say something about Castle Fest. Um, before I went on vacation, um, the Saturday before we went, we went away Monday, uh, we went to Castle Fest for you who don't know what it is. It's a fantasy event. Um, Everyone is dressed up. Well, people want to. Most people are dressed up. Uh, cosplay, fancy, uh, gothic style, Victorian style. Um, I was uh, a gothic fantasy elf, a forest elf. Um, normally I'm more into blue colors and uh, mostly I'm a dragon witch. Um, but this time I thought, hey, just do something else. So I was a gothic forest elf. I think I can edit the video so I can show you some pictures. Um, well, after I was back from vacation, which was awesome, um, I couldn't wait to work then. So that's something I did. Um, one of the most awesome things are uh, some collaboration photos, lookbook photos I got back. I um, collaborated with Diadra. I hope I pronounced it right because I don't really know how to pronounce it. Diadra, I think. Um, she's awesome and uh, I had sent her the Victoriana necklace and uh, a headdress also from that set. And I, I hoped she would do something fancy, elfish with it. And she absolutely did. The colors are stunning and I'm so happy with the photos. Uh, I think I can show you the photos. The colors are very bright. Um, I will link her Facebook account in the descriptions uh, because, well, if you maybe want to collaborate with her or you are a jewelry designer in the alternative uh, styles, I can absolutely recommend her because her, her photos are just stunning. Well, that was one thing. Um, the Victoriana necklace is available in my Etsy shop and at the moment I am working on uh, different colors. Uh, for example, this purple silver one. Hmm, I don't think I get it sharp on camera. Maybe when I go out of the way. Yeah, this one. Um, and I'm planning on making more uh, colors. Um, I think when I post this video online, I will have several colors in my Etsy shop. Then... Something else. Uh, yeah. I still love to work with Amethyst. It's just a lovely gemstone. And I designed this necklace. It has Amethyst beads and a Amethyst Kabunchen. And I just really like the Victorian style of it. I finished and decorated with uh, clay. Then this one I showed you before my vacation. I attached a chain to it and when I post this video online I'm definitely sure it is available in my Etsy shop. Well, then something else. Um, besides making jewelry, I'm also a illustrator. Uh, I, at the beginning of this year, I try to sketch every day something that's mm, not really working out very well. But I still try to sketch a lot. Although after all the sketching, you get a little bit tired, and I wanted to do something with colors again. So I sketched in, I scanned in a sketch, and I worked it out in Photoshop. Let me see where it is. Yeah. This one. Uh, mermaid and her friend. That's what I call it. Um, when I digitize a sketch, I scan it. Um, 
And with this one, I did the line drawing in Photoshop. I have a set of brushes that I absolutely love. That are the ones I use most. And with, well, I make textures. I really love to make textures with paint, with ink, with marble techniques, also marble techniques. Um, and then I just play around with it in Photoshop till I get the colors and texture that I like. Uh, I think I can show you some images of uh, the end result. I uploaded it to Society6. Um, I have an account there for, I think, a year or something, maybe a little bit less. And I'm also thinking about opening an account on Redbubble because those are the two biggest ones in the market if you want your uh, illustrations or products but don't want to produce it yourself. Well, I am thinking about producing some products with my illustrations on it myself, but they will be different than the ones that I upload on Society6 and Redbubble, um, which is really an outcome when you don't have the money or uh, the possibility to make all your own products with illustrations. So it's, it, it, it earns less than when you make it yourself, but it's also a lower risk. That about illustrations. Um, then something I'm really excited about is Halloween. Halloween is my most favorite holiday of the year and I'm already working on uh, Halloween designs. Um, some of them are just variation of designs that I already have. Um, for example, those ones. Um, I kind of have these ones already in my shop. But this one have uh, a swirly part around it that I really like. I make it with clay and it's just it's, it's just a nice detail. Um, there will also be a lot of new designs. Um, I have this charm for a while now and I still haven't used it. It's a moon charm and I really like it. I will make this ones into earrings and probably when I post uh, this video those are already available in my shop. Uh, then I don't know if you uh, follow me on Instagram and have saw previous designs of me but I have a um, Wiccan Integrity necklace. It's with pentagram charms and um, well I like the design and because I like the design I also use that design for Halloween only then with Spiders. It still needs a chain, but I truly think it is an awesome necklace. I will also make it in green, maybe blue, but I'm not pretty sure yet. Just let me know if you think of a color that will be perfect for this necklace. So yeah, a lot of is going on, and um, that was kind of everything that I wanted to share with you for now. Um, I will try to keep making updates. I don't know if I'm going to... Uh, I'm not setting a time for it, so every week or every month or something, just when I have time and uh, something to share or tell you, I will. Um, if you have any questions, don't be afraid to ask them and, uh, well, hopefully I'll see you next time.